Curiosity brings change. It makes your mind active and capable of identifying new and unexpected horizons, which are normally not visible. The European Research Council promotes creativity and innovative research. Its mission is to encourage the highest quality research in Europe through funding and to support research across all fields on the basis of scientific excellence. I was funded in 2009 by ERC with a grant, advanced grant, uh, called nanotherapy. We demonstrated using animals that we have reduction of cancer by 30% in two weeks. Having this significant result, we were motivated to move on with this technology and use it for humans. Damage in the genome is a very important factor for carcinogenesis, as well as uh, premature aging and uh, other related uh, human uh, pathologies. So one such uh, syndrome is the cocaine syndrome, uh, that actually is the objective of this uh, ERC proposal. We hope that with our uh, studies we will shed light into the complex phenotype of cocaine syndrome, as well as associated uh, disorders, and uh, will help uh, counselling and diagnosis and uh, therapeutic intervention where possible. ERC grants are very long, uh, up to five years, and uh, this will enable uh, researchers to dedicate themselves to research and also uh, fund graduate students and postdocs to do research, so enhance the uh, research uh, culture in general. The, the general idea behind the project is to look at the role of the European Court of Human Rights and influence religious pluralism. The European Court of Human Rights happens to be taking incredibly um, controversial decisions to do with religion. And so I look at, uh, at the court's uh, activities from the perspective of a political sociologist of religion. Excellence of uh, the ERC uh, funding we are talking in Greece, has a significant impact because um, of the level of the funding. In my case, it was two millions. We bought very good equipment, state of the art, and also we have the opportunity to attract, due to the label ERC, the best scientists of Greece. How can innovation be achieved under the most adverse circumstances? The recent economic crisis has led to a brain drain in Greece. Many scientists in all sciences have left Greece and that means that we will not have good scientists tomorrow. ERC funding is very important to create new positions and especially among young researchers which is the main uh, affected group of the economic uh, crisis uh, in Greece. It was somewhat disheartening to read so many applications from people with fantastic qualifications, either unemployed or working in jobs that were completely unrelated to their backgrounds. Sometimes it is difficult to combine research and family life. In a sense, I think it's challenging to reconcile any engaging form of employment with engaged parenthood. I very much appreciate that the ERC and the application guidelines ask you to explain any unusual um, deviations in your career trajectory. Um, so here, this was an opportunity for me to explain that I had two breaks in my career for giving birth to two children, which of course entails um, a less productive period in terms of writing and publications. Um, I appreciate that the European Research Council takes that into consideration. Women researchers should definitely apply for ERC, not thinking about uh, parental issues and uh, so on, because uh, the scientific excellence and the research uh, achievements is the main criteria for ERC and not the gender of the candidate. By challenging Europe's brightest minds, the ERC expects that its grants will help to bring about new and unpredictable discoveries. 
It's very often in uh, research that uh, in order to achieve uh, big discoveries, it will require to conduct uh, high risky projects. ERC funds uh, a scientific excellence. Uh, its motto is high risk, high gain. I'm certain there are far more talented researchers in Greece who simply don't imagine the ERC grant as a possibility. So that's a necessary first step, to just imagine it as possible. There are many good Greek social uh, scientists abroad. ERC grants can be used uh, to lure them back to Greece, where they can also promote uh, the general spirit of uh, doing research, being rewarded for doing good research. I would be very happy if from this laboratory will come out a drug that will save lives. I'm very sure, I'm very convinced that this will happen.